An exciting one today from the Indiana Farmers Coliseum to wrap up the Thanksgiving holiday. IUPUI wins in overtime against Cleary. Rick Johnson and the Hall of Famer Bob Lovell. Coach, IUPUI had the lead for 12 minutes, but it was the right 12 minutes. Well, it was the right 12 minutes. I like how they did it. You know, they uh, you know, early on in the game, you know, Cleary had a great offensive output from their backcourt. You know, you see Benny Crenshaw, Chris Williams getting to the rim and finishing. And um, their back cuts were a problem uh, defensively for IUPUI early. And I loved how Cleary was able to go out there and take command of the game early on. But the Jags stayed with it, battled back, and made some plays deep, and come out with a W. Long two there from Cole on the other side for IUPUI. It was the Jalen Counter show. He had a game high 21. Well, he was uh, Jalen Counter, I and mean, this is what he does. I mean, he scores a multitude of ways. He can knock down open threes, can get to the rim and finish the little floater. You know, Vincent Brady came in, uh, did some good things going to the room, to the rim. I mean, you had a, a great number of guys who made some big, big plays for the Jags when they needed to down the stretch. You see the Brady corner three there, and Monroe slices in a little floater there. In overtime, proves to be the difference today for the Jags. Excellent shooting day for Cleary, uh -huh. where the Cougars get, fell into trouble, though. The three-point shooting and the free-throw shooting today. Well, the free-throw shooting was a, a particular problem. Obviously, 7-23 of 23 is just you know, uh, unacceptable, if you will. But they shot it well. They played hard. I think the Jags can draw a lot from this. You know, they, they battled back. They found ways to win. You got to learn how to win. You got to learn how to make plays, which you were able to do at both ends of the floor, uh, and come out with a hard fought win. Next up for the Jags, they start Horizon League play on the road at Wright State coming up next week.